Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Aquarius. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of December 28th through January 3rd. Now, keep in mind that not every reading is for you, so this reading may not be for you. Just take what resonates and leave the rest, and the timing is still fluid. So, what do we have for Aquarius? We can get an overall energy, <clears throat> excuse me from the universe this is a message from the universe right here so what do we have for aquarius happy new year what do we have for aquarius alchemist so this is a temperance card you are very powerful this is a very powerful week of change for you you're evolving okay if we can get that to zoom in this is a very it's almost like a magic okay because alchemy is magic okay it's a very magical week you are changing you're evolving and you're, you're becoming a different person and that would make sense that would make sense at this time so i feel like uh this is evolutionary change okay it begins or it's beginning or it has begun all right you may you may need to just go with the flow allow and accept i feel like you're gonna be doing a lot of uh blending okay this is blending to accept you know you're gonna need to cooperate as you are changing your energy is changing big time now this comes after the death card okay so this is a new life this is the beginning of a new life Well, look at that. That's too many. We're going to keep going. Um, so, yeah, it's a time of change. Great, great, great change for you. It's accepting it. It's accepting that change is needed. Rose. Romance is in the air. Ego. Try Ego. Ego. Triumph over troubles, obstacles, so you will be triumphant. Chain, chain of events that will affect your life. And that is exactly what's going on during this time with the Saturn-Jupiter conjunction. You are going to be experiencing great change, okay? You're going to be victorious, and there's going to be a chain of, chain of events that change everything. It changes everything may have to do with your love life if you're single for example there could be a love rolling in you're not expecting it but whatever if you're in a commitment you could be changing your status okay this is a major change it is so you're going to be experiencing a major uh, change all right um romance is in the air if you are if you say for some of you if you have and now this is um if you think about the temperance card you know it's like exchanging something for something better so that's what this is about it's like silver for gold Fool reversed. So the fool reversed is fearful. A need to take a risk. Allow. Allow. Allow yourself. Allow these changes to happen. Please. You need to allow. Let go of your fear. Have blind faith. You may, you may feel like, I mean, this is somebody that's ignoring advice. They're going through a change. I'm unwilling to change. Let go of your fear. This is fear of change. Oh my goodness. Things keep falling out. 
there could be a falling out even with the full reverse interesting that could be a falling out so yeah there could be a falling that could be part of the event that's <laughs> there could i can't make this shit up so yeah there could be a falling out of some sort could be dealing with Sagittarius, could be dealing with an Aries. This says Dominion. It's the Two of Wands reverse. Now this is a sudden situation, sudden departure, sudden arrival. This is a foolish mistake, perhaps. This is a fall from grace. Somebody may have missed something. There could be some unfinished business, a missed opportunity. There's there's a need to have faith, a need to step into unknown territory, a need to believe. But there's a lack of, uh, well, there's a lot of indecisiveness and there's a lot of fear here. Anyway, the two of wands reversed is stuck, needing to make a decision, torn between two paths. Can't really make that decision. There's a poor judgment call. Somebody's making a poor judgment call and they're staying stuck, you know? There's fear of change here. There is. This is serious fear of change. And there's going to be an event or there's events that are happening that are going to make you face your fears. So get prepared to accept change. Whether you like it or not. And this is, I'm not listening. Ha! Uh, you can't fight the, the universe. And if you do, it's just going to make it worse. Allow and accept whatever is happening. That is advice that you probably should listen to, even though I know you're probably not going to. There could be a sudden arrival or a sudden return, you know, just saying. And it may, it may be, it could be for your partner. It might not be for you. Could be for your partner. Could be for you. Could be for your partner. There could be a sudden arrival or return, you know, or even a departure of a partner. Two's are partners. And this is unaware, totally unaware, oblivious. Somebody may be oblivious. Something is coming. Chain of events that affect your life. Get ready. Get prepared. Success unfulfilled, this card says. It's the Seven of Pentacles. Somebody's been investing in something, trying to make something grow where there's no growth. There's no light. It's only darkness. Somebody's Somebody's been trying to... Uh, been waiting, been waiting and waiting, waiting and waiting for something to, to happen where it's just not going to happen. So there's no fertility there. There's no more growth. This is foolishly waiting for something to change. We don't have to wait much longer because things are going to change, but I don't think they're going to change the way you expect them to change. Okay. Mm. Six of Pentacles reversed. Woo! A lack of success in some some endeavor. Now the Six of Pentacles reversed is uh, a fraud. You know, not listening to any advice again. Lack, not seeking professional advice, not listening to advice. There's some sort of injustice here, a one-sidedness. There could be um, inequality or strings attached, um, charity or strings attached. I'll give you this, but wanting something in return, you know. Uh, you know, there could be a loss of money. Okay, somebody has invested in something that is not profitable by the looks of things. There's no profit coming in. There's one-sidedness. There's one-sidedness. There's re There could be a rejection that is coming up. Somebody could be coming. I mean, I hate to say this, but this for some of you won't be for everybody. This is like an unemployment and becoming unemployed. There's no more resources. There's not enough resources. And that's not going to be for everybody. But the Six of Pentacles reversed is... Uh, I don't know. It's a loss of financial stability, put it that way. It's it's not receiving. Somebody is not going to get what they thought they were gonna get, which I can see. They're gonna get something better. You you may not you don't see it. You don't see it, but you're gonna get something better. Everything happens for a purpose. This is a card of purpose. 
Okay, so you may, you may, or this may have happened in the past. It may have happened already. You may have been rejected for something. You may have been rejected or your partner. There's a rejection here. It's like there's a rejection. Somebody may be coming back. You know, they may be, they may be coming back to invest. It could be for you. It could be for your partner. That's what it looks like to me. There's, this is an evolution. Somebody may have evolved. They may have changed. They may have made a foolish mistake. I'm just saying. I'm just saying there could be a relocation on the horizon as well. There's been some sort of um, lack of growth, you know, and that's what makes it causes somebody's evolution. So I feel like there's going to be um, it feels like somebody is coming back around. Maybe this person and it could have something to do with the job. I don't know what it is, but it could have something to do with the job. There's been a lack of success. Somebody may have abused their power, you know. They've been rejected. There's definitely some sort of rejection here with this card. Or they're going to be rejected. There is a chain of events that is definitely going to affect your life. You're going to be triumphant. And it does have to do with love. This has to do with love. <laughs> What a mess. It's a mess. It is a mess. I know that it is. I can tell. Things are falling apart. Okay, they're falling apart. I think they're falling apart fast. So, and that's because you deserve something better. Or somebody does. Oh my God. Death. Now, death is an ending. It's a major ending. Ending. It's a pro. And I said the temperance comes after death. This is a profound life change. Endings lead to new beginnings. So this is a time of transition. You are going to be transitioning from one phase right into another. Okay. This is a dead end. There's no growth here. There's an opportunity for a new life. Get prepared. Get prepared. Okay. Seriously. There's going to be a major change. You're moving away from something as well. You're moving away from something that is not fertile. There's no growth. It's a dead end. King of Cups. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, uh, Pisces, Cancer. But this is a feelings, expressing feelings. We have a very feeling individual that is going to be expressing their feelings. This is somebody that has some good intentions that is going to be making you an offer of some sort that does give you an opportunity to start a new life. But endings come first because of this death card. There's an ending that comes before this new life. It's going to be a very emotional time. It's going to be an emotional offer. This is somebody who is very, um, it's a very feeling king, very intuitive expressing their feelings so somebody's going to be expressing feelings okay it's going to be a very feeling time use your intuition during this time you're going to need to use your intuition um massive change somebody has been thinking about it too They've been thinking about it. They've been thinking about it and thinking about it and thinking about it. Planning, perhaps, because where they're at, there's been, there's been some sort of lack. Somebody's been lacking. They made a poor judgment call, and they're coming back around. And it, it could be, it could, for some of you, it could be a job offer, okay? But there's been some sort of rejection. Hangman reverse. You could be dealing with Pisces. We have Pisces, Scorpio, and Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But like I said, thinking, 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 thinking. Somebody's become enlightened. They have a new perspective now. They've changed. They've evolved. And whether they're coming back for you or coming back for your partner. Okay? Because we have a partnership here. Um, there's been a level of indecisiveness. There's been an injustice. Okay? There has been an injustice. Now somebody... Somebody may have wanted to punish another person, you know, or they were in their ego, but it feels like there's some sort of big change that has happened.
get prepared for a new beginning with that death card. Somebody's going to be offering you or offering your partner, okay, a new beginning. Knight of Cups. Somebody's looking for a relationship. Somebody wants a relationship and they are definitely going to be making an offer. There's going to be an offer or an invite that really is very, very emotional. It's heartfelt. It's going to be a heartfelt offer. This is, this is somebody that, this is like somebody entering. This is an entrance of some sort, making an advance. This person is unpredictable and their heart is guiding them in a new direction. Somebody wants a new beginning. This is, a, this, seriously, somebody wants a new beginning. Get prepared for an offer, an invite. I feel like it's from a water sign. There could be an admirer here. There is, a, there is an admirer here. There's an admirer here that is about to express their feelings. Okay, there they are. They're going to express their feelings in a very big way. This is over the top. It feels like it's over the top. This is, a, this is a new beginning that you did not see coming. You did not see it coming at all. This may, this may be a struggle. It may be for you, this may be a struggle for you to accept. Because this is a struggle and they're mirroring accept. You, this, this, this will probably be a struggle for you to accept. Maybe, you, maybe there's news of a proposal. You know, and that may be what you have to accept. Or the past has to accept. Something about a proposal here. This is a new life. So you have an opportunity for a new life here. After something ends, something better is coming. There is something better. Get prepared for a massive change. Everything happens for a reason. You have something better. It's definitely going to be emotional. It's going to be an emotional week. I mean, the death card is a separation or a loss with a new beginning to follow. It's time to go someplace else. That's what this is. You are, somebody is headed towards a lot of love. That's where they're headed. And this is the week of accepting and allowing this change to happen. Totally unprepared with that four reversed. That is unprepared. You are unprepared for something. Unprepared to receive some sort of news, whatever the hell it is. God, it's such a mess. It really is. I think there's also going to be a falling out that changes everything. That starts with a falling out. Knight of Pentacles reversed. Now there's been some sort of delay. We have somebody here that is very, very stubborn, extremely stubborn. This is unplanned. Not very, this is an unplanned situation. This is totally not planned. Okay. Unplanned ending that leads to a new beginning in love. Trust me, it does. I wonder if there's somebody here that has been unfaithful. You know, it could be an ex-partner even. 
doesn't have to be. It could be an ex-partner of yours or your your person's. Or it could be the person you're with. It feels like there's... I mean, the Knight of Pentacles reverse can be unfaithfulness. And this could be won't change. This person will never change. So somebody will never change. They could receive an offer from somebody else and, you know... somebody's intuition leads them to find out or something because there's a lot of intuition here ace of pentacles golden opportunity getting an offer for sure somebody is getting an offer that is going to make them it's going to make them feel very emotional it's going to give them an opportunity for a new beginning it's going to lead them down the path to stability and security this is something you can touch it could be a new home a new job um a new partner something bigger and better this is a yes answer accept it accept 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 the new beginning. Accept that this something is over. You have a huge opportunity here. Somebody's going to be getting a gift as well. They're going to be getting an offer that uh, there's been a there's been a long delay because somebody was struggling. They were really really struggling to um, make this offer because they were thinking a lot. They were thinking 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 thinking. They may have even felt inadequate. Um, but get prepared for a major change. Life is about, life as you know it, is about to change. You are about to go down a path towards abundance. Okay, this is an abundance of of wealth, of security, and love. Okay, so this is, this is everything that you ever asked for. It really is. With that Ace of Pentacles next to these Knight of, these, these, these cups, the King of Cups and the Knight of Cups. Get prepared to receive an offer that it makes you uh, very, very happy. Okay, this is a, this is a, this is, it could be an offer from a bank. It could be an offer from a person. Okay, this is an, a secure, stable opportunity that, uh, I mean, the death cut, that, that transforms your life. Okay, this opportunity transforms your life and it moves you away from a situation that is not fertile so get prepared to receive this offer from somebody that uh there's been a delay but i feel like the delays are over i feel like the change is here it's time it's time it's time it is because this is about about timing it's time it's time for you to receive after you were, you it feels like you've been rejected. Now it's time. Triumph over troubles or obstacles. And that's exactly what this is. You are about to receive everything. Okay, you are. This is your time. This is love and abundance. Long-term stability. Good luck. Oh, some of you are moving. Chariot, you're, get, you're packing up and leaving home. Moving to a better place. Taking charge. Being in charge. This is victory. Overcoming challenges. Definitely. You're in charge this week. You're in the driver's seat. You are definitely headed in the right direction. There could also you could also be dealing with a cancer. I don't know if you, this could be cancer, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. I have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio here quite a bit. So this is who you're dealing with. I feel like whoever you're dealing with is probably going to be a relocation. Things are going to happen fast. You could be moving very fast in a new direction. The answer is yes. If you're, if, if you are, yes. Okay. If you have a yes or no answer, the answer is yes. This is what you've been waiting for. Good luck. 